Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we are going to discuss the following question which says that Sam has a garden in his house in which he has rose flower plants. The number of red rose flower plants is 2 less than 5 times the number of pink rose flower plants. Form an equation and represent this relationship on the graph. Now the question says that Sam has a garden in which he has rose flower plants where the number of red rose flower plants is 2 less than 5 times the number of pink rose flower plants. Now we need to form an equation for this relationship and also we shall represent this relationship on the graph. Before forming an equation for the given statement, we first identify the independent variables and the dependent variables. Now we shall learn about independent variables and dependent variables. In a system, independent variables are taken as inputs which can be given specific values freely and variables that are determined by Other variables in the expression or if their values depend on the values of the independent variables are called dependent variables with this key idea let us move on to the solution now the question says that the number of red rose flower plants is 2 less than 5 times the number of pink rose flower plants and we need to form an equation for this relationship before we form an equation, we have to first identify which is the dependent variable and which is the independent variable. Here, the number of red rose flower plants depends on the number of pink flower plants so let the number of pink rose flower plants
dx which is the independent variable and let the number of red rose flower plants be y which is the dependent variable and from the key idea we know that independent variables are taken as inputs which can be given specific values freely and the variables that are determined by other variables in the expression or if their values depend on the values of the independent variables are called dependent variables and we are given that number of red rose flower plants is 2 less than 5 times the number of pink rose flower plants that is we have number of red rose flower plants is equal to 5 into number of pink rose flower plants minus 2 or we can write it as number of red rose flower plants which is denoted by y is equal to 5 into number of pink rose flower plants that is x minus of 2 hence y is equal to 5x minus 2 is the required equation now let us draw this on the graph for this we first draw the table to obtain the ordered pairs here first row of the table is for x second is for y and third is the row for the resultant ordered pair x y let the values for x be 0 1 and 2 and if the value of x is 0 and we know that y is given by 5 into x minus 2 that is 5x minus 2 so here we substitute the value of x as 0 and we get 5 into 0 minus 2 which is equal to 5 into 0 is 0 minus 2 that is minus 2 so here we get the value of y as minus 2 so x is equal to 0 y will be equal to minus 2 so the ordered pair Obtained is given by zero minus two. Now, if x is equal to one, then the value for y will be equal to five into one minus two. That is five minus two, which is equal to three. So we get y is equal to three. If the value of x is equal to 1, then the value of y is given by 3, and the ordered pair so obtained is 1, 3. And lastly, if the value of x is equal to 2, then the value of y will be equal to 5 into 2 minus 2, that is 5 into 2, that is 10 minus of 2. Which is equal to 8. So we get the value of y as 
दैट इज इफ द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू टू देन वी गेट द वैल्यू ऑफ वाई एज एट एंड द ऑर्डर्ड पेयर इज टू एट वी शेल प्लॉट दीज पॉइंट ऑन द ग्राफ वील ड्रॉ दी पेपेंडिकुलर एक्सेस एंड मार्क पॉइंट्स ऑन एट सो हेयर वी हैव द हॉरिजोंटल एक्सेस एंड द वर्टिकल एक्सेस द हॉरिजोंटल एक्सेस एक्स रिप्रेजेंट्स द इंडिपेंडेंट वेरिएबल्स एंड द वर्टिकल एक्सेस वाई वील रिप्रेजेंट द डिपेंडेंट वेरिएबल्स नाउ वी शेल मार्क द पॉइंट ऑन दिस ग्राफ फर्स्ट लेट एस टेक द पॉइंट जीरो माइनस टू वी मार्क जीरो ऑन द एक्स एक्सेस एंड माइनस टू ऑन द वाई एक्सेस एंड वी गेट द पॉइंट जीरो माइनस टू नेक्स्ट वी मार्क द पॉइंट वन थ्री बाय टेकिंग वन ऑन द एक्स एक्सेस एंड थ्री ऑन द वाई एक्सेस and we get the point 1 3 similarly we mark the point 2 8 by taking 2 on the x axis and 8 on the y axis and we get the point 2 8 now we have got all the three points on the graph and then we join the three points and obtain a straight line by joining these three points and this is our required graph this completes our session hope you enjoyed this session